Hey all, it's Moonbeam Honeysuckle Smith here coming to you with a product review. So this past weekend I went up to Westchester, Pennsylvania uh, to watch some bicycle racing and Penn Med uh, was giving out you know cowbells to uh, make a lot of noise especially during the uh, elite races which I enjoyed using that but at one point I looked down at my hand and I realized that I had scraped up my knuckles and I was like, well, jeepers, I haven't been doing anything crazy. Uh, I didn't crash during my bike race. And, but then I looked at the bell and realized that I had skin on there. So uh, one of the products I got a couple months ago, uh, it was active skin repair. So I'm gonna see if what it does since finally, I have a skin issue. So, as you can see, I kind of rubbed raw uh, two of my knuckles. And uh, when I woke up Sunday morning, I wasn't sure what was wrong with me. Um, you know, I'd cleaned them up uh, Saturday night when I got back to my hotel and all. But uh, I was kind of worried because my fingers were kind of locked out because they're, these two uh, sore spots are right on the knuckles. Yeah, I figured this would be a great reason to make a little YouTube video. So here we go. All right, once again, it's the Active Skin Repair. And let's see, liberally apply to the affected area. I'm not gonna use a gauze dressing, or maybe I should, but I don't have any gauze. All right, well. I'm gonna see what it does just spraying directly on my hand and if my hand falls off, we'll know why. Maybe I should, I live close to a drugstore. Maybe I should end up investing in some gauze. Actually, I just came up with an idea. I, uh, I think in this same kit, I ended up getting a first aid kit, but too late, I already sprayed it on my knuckles. So maybe next time uh, or later on, if this doesn't work the way I just did it, live and learn experiment. I'm gonna let this dry, I guess. Yeah, I'll see uh, what this does later. I sprayed directly onto uh, the two sore spots. Um, later on, I think I never ended up putting the first aid kit in my car that I had gotten. So uh, I believe there were gauze pads in there. Um, I also have Q-tips upstairs I could use. I know that could possibly leave fuzzies on it, but all right, well, see how this uh, settles, and I'll come back at you later. Hey, adventurers, it's Moonbeam Honeysuckle Smith, and as promised, I wanted to talk a little bit today about one of the products I've received in June from my Cairn box, and it's the active skin repair um, so as you can recall I kind of scraped up my knuckles last weekend uh, at some bike races because of a cowbell from Penn Medicine there's yeah remains of my fingers on the top of this um, that caused uh, some rubbing on my two knuckles. So I've been using this active skin repair uh, spray for about a week and I'm not really sure if I've noticed anything. Um, they're definitely naturally scabbing over and everything. Still, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do. Afternoon, I noticed my toe that I was missing some skin and I walked around last week a lot in my Merrill sandals that I've had oh for almost 11 years because they're comfortable however um, either from getting wet or something other causing a raw spot so I as of oh half hour ago I am using this active skin repair and since this is a fresh wound um, whereas with my fingers um, I kind of waited a couple days before I started using it so literally within the last half hour I noticed that um, my toe had been rubbed raw 
and automatically I've already sprayed twice on it. I guess eventually I'll find out what it does, this product. Um, so far, I'm not sold on it. I mean, it hasn't really acted like Neosporin or anything for me so far. But uh, hopefully, since I've caught my toe uh, in the early stages, um, maybe this time it'll actually do whatever it's supposed to do. So, all right. I'll see you all later, adventures. Peace. And one last thing, adventures. So, if you find my video helpful, hit the like button. If you want to know when my videos are published, hit the little bell and go ahead subscribe.